YouTube was like 10 seconds until the, the stream starts. And then it was like, went back up to 20 minutes. And then the stream started. YouTube never ceases to amaze me. What's up guys? ESO here. Welcome back to the channel. I hope you are all very, very well. Today we are continuing our companion Let's Play. We are quite deep into it. So this episode we're basically going to become a werewolf. And I've actually got a few mods installed. First we've got the werewolf retexture. Because let's be honest, the old vanilla retexture or the vanilla texture wasn't very good. So we've got a retexture for I think 2k retexture 2000 pixels and we also have a extended werewolf perk tree so it has the original perks and a few others because I want to keep it quite close to the original for anyone using this as a walkthrough what the did Lydia just make that sound that was really weird 
I'm right behind you. Okay. Not sure about this, Lydia. I wanted to jump back onto this Let's Play, guys, because you guys miss Lydia. I got a lot of comments about it. Let me know if you're we need our crazy companion who does very strange stuff in our videos. I mean, that's what makes it funny. I hope you guys are well. Thank you for joining the stream today. So we've actually got this quest, and this quest is pretty cool. It works out really well for us, because I get to show you guys where a unique weapon is. Clear out Crystal Drift Cave. Basically, it's just a random miscellaneous quest you'll get after you finish the last quest from the last stream. Um, and you'll get this random location. Crystal Drift Cave just happens to have a unique item in and a very funny story that I want to share with you guys. I already did a video on it, I think maybe a couple of years ago. But, you know, maybe some of you new folks or whatever haven't seen it yet. So I'm going to share it with you now. Bloody hell, I'm to my voice, so that was weird. Almost lost it. I've got your back. I agree, Scyther. Is that meant to be a Yu-Gi-Oh reference, by the way? Okay, so we're going to fast travel over. We're not in survival mode currently because I'm doing this as a walkthrough. So it's just going to be like, you know, total action. Crystal Drift Cave over here, just southwest from Riften. You've already pretty much discovered every location on this character. Oh, okay. There are some woofs. Lydia! Watch Lydia just butcher these. Oh my god, you savage Lydia. Only a fool lets himself get surrounded. And then she was like surrounded. Can you guys see that fire over there? Is that a fire astronaut? It's like a mage. What? There's actually a bear over there as well. Oh my god, here we go. Okay. Oh my god, I actually hit him. Okay, here we go. Hit the next one. <gasps> what the? <laughs> what the? <laughs> what was that? And there we have it. My bear pelt has been delivered. 10 out of 10, guys. Give the video a like for that, man. Come on. What is that? This is like pro hunting skills with ESO. You make the bear fly over to you with your perfect archery skills. Lydia, what do you think of that skill? She's so impressed. Look at her. She's like, yeah. Mwah. Okay. I actually want to see... Oh, where, where even was that bear? At the end of last stream as well, we had like some crazy archery long shots going on. But I mean, that just takes the biscuit, guys. I don't really know what to say about that. I think he was killing a mage just over here. So we should find a dead mage, maybe. Oh, okay, yeah, yeah. Oh, a hag. Black mage robes, a heavy leather backpack, and some boots and a steel dagger. I don't really need any of this stuff, to be honest. I kind of don't want the backpack on because it ruins that look with the bow, you know what I mean? It's funny because the, the video is slightly delayed, so um, you guys have only just seen what happened. Oh my god, there's a fox. Let's see if we get some crazy kill cam. Look at this fox. He's like running on the spot. Flee from me, Mr. Fox. Oh my god, Lydia literally just saved him. Get wrecked. Ah, oh, that one didn't fly into the air. I love Skyrim for its randomness sometimes. Okay, so there's a dead deer out here that the wolves were feasting on. I assume there's just going to be a few animals in this cave. There's also a lantern, which indicates that there may be human inhabitants here. Potentially. We are on, I think, maybe expert difficulty. I like to keep it on that so the enemies don't become bullet sponges. Get wrecked, spider. We're actually going to need this spider venom for later. Oh my goodness, you creepy arachnid. That one literally got it right between the teeth. Hello, Jax. How are you? Good to see you in the chat again, bro. Lydia's got a bad feeling about this, guys. So as you can see, something has just been absolutely butchered. There are some ribs left over. There's also a campfire here. In fact, there are... Look, these, these carrots kind of look like they're enchanted carrots. They've got like a, a glow to them. There's also some leeks, um, a potato, a cabbage. Oh, goodness me. There's everything we need, actually, to make a vegetable soup, apart from tomatoes. Let me see if I have any tomatoes. 
Aha! Vegetable soup. This is really good for stamina regeneration. One tomato, especially if you're a vampire. Lydia, shut up. I'm trying to do cookery on my channel. Thank you. An apothecary satchel with some rarer alchemy ingredients. They're not actually rare. There's also a chest here. But what I wanted to show you guys is this unique still weapon. Here. I know you're still here, Lydia. You're always here. If you jump on this rock in the middle, you'll actually see if I can actually get up. There is somebody called Gad Gadnor. He looks like a high elf, doesn't he? Seven gold, a random book. Oh, that's actually a skill book, maybe. Uh, iron arrows, and he's also got Gandalf's Staff of Charming, which is, of course, unique. And this is the funny part, guys, because this is where you figure out what actually happened to him. There it is. Gandalf's Staff of Charming. David, thank you for the donation, sir. Get wrecked, son. Exactly. We're going to have the Get Wrecked hoodie coming out very soon. I've been promised it's going to be soon, guys. They're just sorting it out, doing the final finishing touches. Then we're going to have a new merch hoodie coming out. It's going to be awesome. I cannot wait. The artwork, those of you who are on my Patreon have already seen it. You guys are going to love it. Anyway, so as you guys can see, Gandalf's Staff of Charming. So clearly Gandor intended to come in here and charm some animals. Maybe make some friends with the animals. But if you actually read the enchantment, it says creatures and people up to level 4 will attack anything nearby for 60 seconds. So basically, he used this staff of charming and accidentally made all the creatures in the cave attack him. So clearly he was just hiding on this rock, trying not to get killed by all these spiders. Let's have a little hop over here. I can't remember if there's another chest. Oh, Jesus Christ. Hello there. Come on, Lydia. Where is he going? Oh my goodness. What is this crab walking spider? Do any of you guys remember the crab walking glitch of Gears of War? Probably not. Maybe I'm getting old. It was Gears of War 1. There was a, a glitch where you could, um, bloody hell, a flying antler. Where you could um, basically keep walking sideways on this car. And it would give you like ultra movement speed and it would also look hilarious. Why is there a chest full of leaks? That is the real question of this dungeon, Lydia. Right, let's carry on now because we've cleared out this cave. That's all we needed to do for this random miscellaneous quest. Now we can fast travel back to where the companions are. And we can continue on with the actual storyline of the companions. Because, I mean, let's be honest, that was the purpose of this video. Can't remember if there was a chest up here as well. I think... Oh, hello. What is that? What is... What is that? I think it's a saber cat. Get wrecked! Oh my goodness. Actually get decimated. I don't know if... Oh, someone can see me. There is another enemy. <gasps> another... Oh my goodness, I've killed your wife, Mr. Saber Cat. This one is a bit more tanky. Donald Lot, thank you very much for the $5 donation. Do a Dragon Age Inquisition walkthrough and I will destroy your enemies. Or I, or give you a fruit basket. I actually couldn't read the rest of that. Let me have a quick look. You'll destroy... And I will destroy your enemies or give you a fruit basket. You know, I actually want to have some time to play Dragon Age Inquisition as well as The Witcher 3. I might do it on my second channel. If you guys haven't subscribed to that yet... Link is in the description below. Thanks for killing it, man. Mr. Hairball, thank you very much for the $10, do $10 donation, sir. Really appreciate that. Right, okay, we've killed these two creatures. And I just want to have a quick look around, because I don't think there is anything here. There were just some wild animals. All right, let's actually fast travel back to Whiterun. And then we can carry on with this main quest line. Slightly faster to go to Dragon Reach, so we'll do that. I'm right behind you. Somebody asked me um, in one of my... Because a lot of my videos have been getting demonetized recently. So I do appreciate all the donations guys, guys a lot. They really do help me out. But um, somebody asked me if my videos were being demonetized because I was killing too much wildlife. Someone, someone genuinely got a bit angry about it in the comment section. I don't think that's why. 
<laughs> Though it did give me a little bit of a chuckle. Mercis mercilessly killing wildlife in Skyrim. <laughs> Not advertiser friendly. <laughs> What armor do you use, ESO? This is the Falmer Ancient Armor. You can get it in the Dawnguard DLC. We've actually already done our Let's Play on this character of that. So let's go and talk to one of the companions to turn in this quest. I've heard you may actually be stronger than you look. Perhaps we can hunt together someday. She's such a babe. Maybe we'll replace Lydia at some point with her. I've cleared the beast's lair. Good to hear. Have your share of the pay. My share, only 300 gold. I'm looking for more work. Still eager to please. This is good. Skewer might be right about you. He has something special planned for you. Better talk to him. So now we're back on the main quest, the Silver Hand. This is actually pretty cool. There's a bit of lore in it and we also get to kill some werewolf haters. So talk to Skajor. Firstly, obviously, we've got to become a werewolf. Let's actually get a torch out right now because... Um, we're going to need that. Oh my goodness. I have so much stuff. Hello, Skajor. Get out of bed. I want ah, to talk. There you are. <laughs> He's literally just got into bed. You wanted to see me. Yes. I have something a little different planned this time. But it's not for everyone to hear. Meet me in the Underforge tonight. We will speak more. Oh, a date. Is it Skajor? Where is this Underforge you speak for? Is it under the forge by any chance? I forget that you've never seen it. Beneath the Skyforge, where Yorland works, the door is hidden. But I will show you the way. Okay, let's go. What does it mean to be a companion? I'll take my leave then. Uh, right. I thought you were showing me the way. Come on. What are you doing that for? What? I'm not doing anything. I'm following you. Maybe I'll steal one of these books. Hmm. Oh, an expert display case to steal a steel dagger. Hilarious. Apparently Lydia knows the way. No, Lydia. Okay, we're not following you, love. I don't think she does. Why does everyone hate Nazim? Well, have you even been to the Cloud District, sir? Whoa, a donation. S. Stone donated $25. Thank you very much, S. Stone. Love your videos. Keep it up. I will definitely be keeping it up. Somebody actually asked me just now when my next build will be. My friend Joe is playing Player Unknown's Battleground. Clearly, he wanted a shout out. That's why he keeps logging in and out. Uh, my next build will be. I want to try and put out two before Christmas. That's my plan. One of you, some of you guys already know one of the builds I'm working on. Ethan, thank you for the $1 donation, man. Really appreciate it. Um, one of the builds I'm working on is going to be a Argonian that uses um, illusion and is a vampire and stealth to um, kill his prey. It's going to be pretty awesome. The backstory for it is going to be very awesome. So I'm pretty excited about that. I've also got to do the vampire half of that build as well. ESO, what mods do you use to overhaul the woman look i think it's like um they have like different body mind. type mods one of them is called cbbe but i don't like that one because it's like super unrealistic sort of like curvy women um this one is like the other version i can't remember what it's called though i remember the version i don't like but not the normal one not now the underforge tonight okay not now the Underforge tonight. I think the entrance is just here, guys. This blatant cutout Not hidden now. by a few bushes. Not now. Okay, are you going to keep spamming me with your dialogue or what? Before we go in and wait um, until night time. Oh, I was going to sell my stuff to to um, the Forge Master, but he does not seem to be here. Aha, there he is. Let's see if we can just sell our stuff and then we will go into the Underforge. My poor Frally, I think Thorod's still alive. Be quiet. I want to sell you some stuff. Oh, one sec. I was told you'd have a weapon for me. Yes, lad. You've been raised into the companions, I hear. I can fashion whatever kind of weapon you want. Finest forge in Skyrim, right here before you. Basically, um, the, the Skyforge is, gives you certain steel weapons that are unique to the Skyforge. They're slightly more powerful than steel weapons, but I mean, this is a bit pointless. I'm just going to ask for a dagger. Ah, 
like this sneaky type, eh? I think we could fix you right up. Bit racist, but I'll take the steel Speed dagger. Got just as much okay, let's ask him what he's got for sale. Gods be praised. Let me show you my... Sell this. The I did review these arrows. They were part of the Creation Club mods. I will link that those uh, mod reviews in the description below. They were quite cheap and quite quite well priced, I guess, but you did have to pay for them. What really annoyed me is that they didn't actually work as they should work. So um, I really did not like them in that regard. I mean, you know, if you're going to pay for something and Bethesda say it's going to be tested, it should at least, um, you know, do what it says on the tin. I actually need to... Okay, Skyforge still dagger, so it actually does slightly more damage than the normal one. But I'm going to sell it because, I mean, there's it's pretty useless to me right now. Vampire boots. Uh, I might as well sell... No, we'll actually keep this because it's uh, quite rare. We can sell this, though. And that's all I want to sell. So, okay, let's wait until mm -hmm. night time and then go into the forge. We can have a view over the world. Look at that render distance, guys. Look at it. Oh, amazing. Okay, 8 a.m. I've literally got to wait a whole day, really? Damn the beast. ESO, I've been subbed for two years now. Keep up the good work. Really enjoy your guys and videos. Thank you very much. I really appreciate the long time support, man. Okay, right. Is this nighttime enough? It's 10 p.m. Maybe we can now go into the secret forge. Should you kill Parthenax, you should definitely not kill him. Ah, oh, here he is. He's coming over now. Just gotta wait half an hour for him to get here. Lydia, hello. Lydia also wants to become a vam. I mean, a werewolf. Sorry. Not now. The Underforge tonight. Okay, it's night time. Not now. Really? What the hell was that noise? It sounded like a dragon crash landing. Not. Okay, past twelve. The Underforge tonight. Not now. Really? Really? Meet with at Forge night. Tonight. Okay, it's definitely night time, guys. Last time I checked. Are you prepared? Yes. What is this place? <laughs> what is it? Here's all you need to know. Your Vasker is the oldest building in White Rock. The Skyforge was here long before it was. And the Underforge taps an ancient magic that is older than men or elves. We bring you here to make you stronger, new blood. Now let's move. You still need to prove yourself, Will. Until <laughs> next time. Savage. Oh, okay. Disappear inside this rock. Goodbye. I'm glad you came. It's been a long time since we had a heart like yours among our numbers. That pitiful ceremony behind the hall does not befit warriors like us. You are due more honor than some calls at feasting. I would hope you recognize Ayla, even in this form. She's agreed to be your forebear. Kinky. You do this in secret because Codlack is too busy trying to throw away this great gift we've been granted. He thinks we've been cursed, but we've been blessed. How can something that gives this kind of prowess be a curse? So we take matters into our own hands. To reach the heights of the Companions, you must join with us in the shared blood of the wolf. Are you prepared to join your spirit with the beast world, friend? No. <laughs> what if I don't want to be a werewolf? Let's see what he says. That is your choice. We will not force you. But to join the circle, your blood must be as ours. Meet us here when you're ready. I am ready now. Very well. Oh, goodness me. Oh, what's he doing? Oh, my goodness. What a savage. Jesus. He chops the, her arm off. Okay, what do you want me to do with this? Participate in blood ritual. Ha ha ha. I am going to suck your blood, Ayla. The blood calls, brother. Okay. Let's, let's, we can't speak to her, can we? Oh, we can. It means resting your haunches in white run more than I'd care to, for one. That just... But when it comes time to draw blood, there's no one in Skyrim I'd rather have at my back. <laughs> it means waking <laughs> That just doesn't sound right coming from her. Okay, let's use the Underforge fountain and become a werewolf. Oh my goodness. I'm right behind you. 
I've become a- Oh my god, Lydia is indeed right behind me. So this is the part where we are now werewolf and we go absolutely crazy. And kill everyone in right run. Rawr. We are actually going to die- Oh my goodness me, this guard is going to get wrecked. Because my one-handed skill is quite low. There's actually a good chance we could die unless Lydia looks after us. I can't even kill a guard. Get wrecked, white run guard. Oh my goodness. I think Lydia actually killed him there. I might need to feast on his flesh so I don't die right now. Is that going to give me enough health? Probably not. Okay, well luckily... The cutscene is over. Why am I in a loading screen? Come on, Skyrim. Okay, now we're in the middle of nowhere. Are you awake? I was starting to think you might never come back. Yours was not an easy transformation, but you're still alive, so congratulations. We even have a celebration planned for you. There's a pack of werewolf hunters camped nearby at Gallows Rock. The Silver Hand. I think you've met them before. We're going to slaughter them. All of them. Lead on. Skior's already scouting ahead. Sam the Iron Man. It's funny that a cat becomes a dog, huh? Yeah, that is pretty funny. <laughs> just, what just happened? You were born into the pack, brother. I almost envy you. That first time is always the most intense. If you know what I mean. even more trouble than Farkas did at his first turning. Am I a werewolf now? <laughs> well, yes, obviously. I'm literally like pissing blood right now. You have the blood of the wolf in you. You'll need to build up your strength before you can call on it again, though. Just be careful where you do it. Some cowards in this land can't stand the sight of glory before them. <laughs> Probably very scared if you just transform into a werewolf in the middle of town. What does it mean to be a werewolf? Nothing until you choose to use it. Then, well, you got a taste. Stronger, faster. It doesn't last long, though. The blood of your foes can sustain you, if you're willing to feed. The more we feed, the greater our prowess will grow. We could perhaps discover even more gifts of her scene. I see. Is there a cure? Cure? Ha! You're sounding like the old man. I... I shouldn't say that. I love Kodlak. I respect and follow him. But he's wrong on this. It's no curse. We're made into the greatest hunters in the land. If he's worried about some mead-swilling afterlife in Sovngarde, he's free to pursue it. I'll take the glories of the hunt right here. Spoken like a worshipper of Hercene. Where are we going? The Silver Hand have taken over the old fort at Gallows Rock. They always make such easy prey. Ah, oh, Cameron. Didn't kill Nazim and you were glad. You're not going to be very popular in this chat room, sir. That's certainly unusual. Is it? What? Okay, so now we have to kill all these silver hand. Now, actually turning into a werewolf and doing this will be extremely difficult for my character. But nonetheless, we're definitely going to be trying that. I do think we should sneak kill anyone outside, though, because, I mean, let's be honest, archery is awesome. But I mean, for popular demand, guys, what do you reckon? Turning into a werewolf and killing some of the guys inside? On this difficulty, though, it's quite hard not to kill everyone without a sneak attack. So, obviously, being the werewolf... I did actually make a werewolf build, which is, like, the best way to play a werewolf character. I will link that down below in the description if you guys are interested. It is actually possible, if you build your character right, to get a ridiculous amount of armor... While even in werewolf form. Why do I have an axe out? I want my bow. Um, iron arrows, that's fine. Let's take this guy out right here. The lookout. Get wrecked. Oh, headshot. Okay, I can't actually see anyone else right now. Oh, no, no. There's a guy just up there. I'll show you what a real orc can do. Oh, really? You actually, like, screwed me over there, Skyrim, because that definitely wasn't meant to hit. Just there. Oh, 
Can't actually see where they've gone. Round the other side. Oh. Oh my goodness. Hello. The Huntress. Where is she going? Okay, guys, we might just jump over here and then go and help her out before she dies. You are a disgrace to your own kind. Get wrecked. Oh my god. Get pelted with arrows. Look at this orc. He's not even hitting Lydia. <laughs> Only a fool will let himself get surrounded. You and Lydia have the same dialogue. I don't like it. Mud crab chitin. The claw. Uh, we don't need anything from you. Your crappy loot is of no value to me. Oh, two-handed skill increased to level 17. Sorry, what? What? What just happened? Synergy skill. I don't understand. Did I install a mod that has something different I didn't read in it? Probably. It annoys me that my two-handed skill has leveled up, though. Please read ESO. You're a werewolf. Lydia tries to kill you. Oh, dear. You're actually right. She does. Sky... Skyrelia donated a hundred dollars. Oh, my goodness. Thank you so much, Skyrelia. I hope I can say your name correctly. You can actually leave a message when you donate. I think you actually just killed the boss, though. So you're now the... Oh, let me check. Let me check. So guys, I have this this app thing on, as you can see on the top at the top corner, the camera's mirrored. So that corner, there is a boss with health. Basically, every time someone donates, it loses health. So you are now the new boss. Congratulations! Thank you very much for the donation as well, man. Really do appreciate that. Orcish armor and orcish helmet. Do we give this to Lydia? Is the question. I think so. Yes, my fae. Yes, my fae. Lydia attacks me if I it turn into a pleasure. werewolf. I actually forgot about this. Thank you for reminding me. Uh, I'm going to give you. Is it actually better than the blade's armor? Car yes, it is. It is. Might as well have the gauntlets as well, Lydia. Oh, God, not the helmet. Take that back. You need to reveal your silky locks. So the blade's armor, 59. This is only 54. Well, we can't have you wearing that now, can we? Ah, I'm just going to take this back off you, because those gauntlets give you 20% more one-handed damage, so you can you keep that I'll lovely. Follow. Okay, we might actually tell Lydia to wait outside. I'm just going to make her wait by the entrance so I don't actually forget to pick her up before we leave. Uh, that wouldn't be good, would it, guys? I mean, let's be honest. It's not the first time that's happened. I need these orcish arrows and orcish bow. I could give that to Lydia. It's better than a crappy steel bow. If you give Lydia one type of, like, one glass arrow, she'll have unlimited glass arrows. So that's a pretty good idea if you're looking to get some extra arrows. You guys are literally having bum fun. Um, I need to trade some things with Here's you. Everything I have. So, look, I'll show you. She won't be... I can't really show you right now because I'm going to tell her to wait outside, but... Oh, God, why am I looking at this? Weapons? Where is my orcish bow? There it is. Uh, then I'm going to give her... Oh, actually, if I give her one lightning arrow, does that mean she has unlimited lightning arrows? That could be hilarious to watch. I wonder if she'll actually use them, though. We'll I test that out later, back. guys. For now, we're going to tell her to wait here. Lydia, come. Oh, my God. An assassin. I've got your back. Wait here. I will remain on guard here. I will remain on guard here. I'm going to cheat on you while I'm inside here. You skooma with the werewolf. Faux show. Chris Parrish, I hate your videos. Thank you very much for taking the time to tell me in the chat. Let's make the Seems like an extreme waste of time. But um, I wonder if she transforms with me. Okay, let's activate this so we can actually... Look at this. Cowards must have locked the place down after Skior charged in. You can taste the fear. I can taste huh? it too, Ayla. Okay, let's... Uh, Use our magical bow. Beast form. Beast. Right, what else do I need? I want to use... What 
do I want to use? Summon Dunavir inside. Fantastic. I want to use the slow time. Oh, actually, no, I don't. There's no point in this. There's no point in me doing this beast form. Okay, great. I'm just going to see who I can spot down here. And I'm going to come around the corner and transform into a beast. Okay, you ready? There's two guys here, Ayla. Let's go take them out. You ready? Wahahaha! I have become something from your nightmares. Ra! Fight me! Imagine a werewolf just coming out of the darkness, just like, what, bro? Get wrecked. Oh my god, the kill move savagely devour this poor man. He had an awesome build beard as well, man. I do feel sorry for him. We're going to feed to uh, increase the length of time we are a werewolf. Bloodline, thank you very much for the donation, sir. Bloodline, how appropriate you have the bloodline of a werewolf. Greetings from Australia. You are awesome. Thank you very much. I think you're the awesome one, though. Luckily, we can open doors as a werewolf. We are actually able to use... No Askeva, look out, Ayla. I've got it. Don't worry. If we use a power attack move, we should actually be able to absolutely knock this guy over so he'll prove no trouble. It's actually a pretty good tactic when you want to get rid of people because otherwise they do quite a lot of damage with those two-handed weapons. If we can actually get the run-up we need, let's actually get them on this trap here. Oh god, he's not going to step on it. I wanted to do something cool with this. Oh my god, I've actually died. Are you kidding me? This is the issue with being a werewolf, guys. On um, Master Difficulty. You do get wrecked sometimes. Okay, let's try this again. Look at this. Cowards must have locked the place down after Skior charge. We might have to um I guess there is another thing I could do, but it won't help me that much. So, you know what, beast form, I guess I could take some potions. I can't remember if you can actually heal in werewolf form, but there you go, that shows how much I play a werewolf. Regeneration. Um, what else do I want? Invisibility? No, an invisible werewolf. I wonder if that's possible to do if I drink the potion at the exact right time. Regeneration. Um, skooma! We can actually have some skooma. There's no point in having it yet because we're at full stamina. So, you know. What else do I want to use? Right, that's fine. That's fine. I am transforming again! I will never get bored of this transformation it looks so awesome almost as awesome as the thumbnail for this video get absolutely decked you fool oh my goodness every time this guy is just like getting destroyed by me nom 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 oh my god i especially want to feast on his leg yes those calves he did not skip leg day. Come at me. Get out of the way, Skeever. You stupid rat. I can't actually feed on a Skeever. Me, donate... Me? Your name is me? Donated? Okay, we're going to have to... Oh, I can't step on the trap. That's interesting. Right, let's get Ayla to actually come out here. We're going to have to be a bit more tactical. Oh my goodness me, I'm almost dead. And we cannot heal as a werewolf, so this is going extremely well for us. Luckily, I have that health regeneration right now. The only way I can see this working out is if Ayla doesn't die. Otherwise, not having a great time, am I? Okay, he's coming round. I need to get a run up on him here. Oh my god! <laughs> Jesus, we might have to turn down the difficulty because killing them as a werewolf... It's really hard on Master Difficulty. Or at least transform so I can uh, not die, potentially. Because if he times that attack right, I'm just going to die again. There we go. This is good. That's not the right way. Let's go this way. Come on, Ayla. Sort it out, love. 
Right. Oh yeah, we have powers as well, don't we? I'm forgetting about this. I can't actually level up at all yet, I don't think. I don't think I have enough. No, we need to feed on some more some more people, I think. Right, let's Great. Another one down. Where's this other guy? Let's quickly feed on him to get some more health. He seems to be stuck around the corner here. I kind of like challenging myself and playing it on harder difficulties. Where's he gone? I'll show you a real fight. Okay, okay. So things come around the corner now. Ha! I think you're bleeding. Oh, Ayla. Jesus. Sorry, babe. Right. Come on. Come on, bro. I dare you. Can't hide from you. Oh, my goodness. I'm messing up this power attack, am I not? <laughs> New sponsor! Thank you very much, Esben Christian. Kirsty, sorry, egg. Kirsty egg. I really need to get some power attacks in here. Otherwise, I'm going to die again. Okay, werewolf perk available. Let's have a look at what we can do. I don't think any of the first perks are actually good. So we're just going to have to get this one. Plus 25% more damage as a werewolf. As you guys can see, this um, perk adds... I mean, this mod adds a lot more perks that extend the lengths of the tree and make it a little bit more interesting. So we'll go over them later if I do decide to level up more as a werewolf. I kind of quite like that you can play an archer and also play as a more ranged character at the same time. We're not going to be able to hit this guy off the chair, but we are going to get a few sneaky power attacks on him. Oh, we can. There we go. Spark cam donated. Thank you very much. Oh, goodness. Hello. Okay, we need to be careful of this guy because that really hurt. Run to the back here. Right, as long as she doesn't hit me with an arrow, we should be fine here. Oh, thank God for that. Get wrecked. Get fed on thank you very much for the donations it's quite fun to watch keep up the good work i'm enjoying it greetings from south africa wow you are far away sir i've actually like what's south africa like i would love to go and visit some of these different countries that are very different cultures to like the uk england okay we're back at like almost full health right now there is someone else down here let's quickly save the game before we absolutely wreck them Hello? Oh, someone upstairs. Sneaky werewolf. I don't really want to charge upstairs right now. There we go. Get wrecked. Ho oh, ho! Man, that damage from the power attack is insane. No, don't hit me with that. Oh, God. Let's load again. <laughs> so funny. I could just detransform, I know, and then we would do this very easily, but um, where's the fun in that? Okay, we'll try it again. Mr. Cheesy, thank you very much for the $20 donation. Hi, ESO, just joined. There we go. It's just that you have absolutely no armor, and that really doesn't help you out. There's actually a boss chest back there, so we will grab that in a moment. Don't hit me with that bow. God, I'm actually getting some uh, frame rate drop there. That was really weird. There we go. You're dead. Let's quickly feed on him. To oh, no, 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 no. That's an archer. Jesus Christ. I'm literally going to die right now. Oh, God. Oh, for goodness sake. <laughs> I might actually have to turn the difficulty down. <laughs> Just so it doesn't become a death montage of me getting wrecked as a werewolf. That is not what I wanted to do. Right, here we go. I want to draw some guys out. Try 
try not to get shot by these arrows because they're like arrows of death. Oh, dearie me. Ayla, I need you to do something, otherwise I'm just going to get Lydia back. Oh, for God's sake, Ayla. Seriously. I might have to just wait an hour until I transform back, because I'm not enjoying this. Getting beaten up as a werewolf. Right. Ayla, I'm not liking you. You don't help me out. You're not tanking for me like Lydia is. Right, wait one hour. How many hours am I going to have to wait until I detransform right now? No? Still? Okay, there we go. That's better. Thank you very much for the donation. Good work, Dan. Keep it up. Nigel. Thank you, sir. Right, let's actually go and assassinate these guys. They've annoyed me now. We're going to clear this whole room without anyone realizing. I might actually tell Ayla to wait there because she's actually useless. She doesn't even do damage with her bow. Do you even know how to sneak, babe? Right, take this guy out. Is someone there? Oh, for... Come on. She, she's useless. I hate her. I actually hate her, guys. I'm going to unrelenting force shout her right into these guys and use her as a human buffer. Get wrecked. Daniel, thank you very much for the donation. I do not know what currency that is, but there is 50 of it. Ayla, actually die. I mean, seriously, you annoy me so much. Silver hand. I will scroll up and read your donation. I'm just going to kill these guys first because they're annoying me. Come out and play. Headshot. Headshot. Look at this guy moaning on the ground. Oh, what? It didn't... The arrow literally got stuck in mid-air just then. <laughs> he stepped back and died. Okay, let's run up there and kill him. Let's put him out of his misery. Get out of here. Come on, then. Oh, actually, you did hit me. I was a little bit slow there, wasn't I? Yes, it is. It's all I need. Ayla, come over here. Wee! He's actually still alive. Get wrecked. I can't believe you can see like Ayla's arrows just missing him continuously. Right, I'm glad he managed to do that. Hello, ESO from wet and cold north of real world Skyrim, aka Sweden. Sweden, another awesome place I want to visit, man. You guys, like, if I ever come to where you are, it, I will let you know on Twitter. You follow me on Twitter. And then we can hang out. You guys can show me some of the sights. Okay, well, thank God we did that, because that was painful to watch me attempt to play a werewolf on an archer build. What happened to this lady? You silly imperial. Okay, let's go and get the boss chest, which is just downstairs here. Just in this room. Sapphire boss chest. Too. Oh, master difficulty. One of those bandits probably has a key. Yeah, maybe, because I can't be bothered to lockpick it. You could give your follower a lockpick to lockpick that for you, but um, I'm not going to bother. Because, to be honest, we already have like 80,000 gold. Zender Hodges. Now we have two more dollars. Do illustration perk effects affect your fear howling thing? You know, I've actually not tested it recently enough to remember. Is this guy literally doing squats or what? What was that? Was it a ghost? How did it move? Hello, sir. Get wrecked. In the other eye? Just here? Oh my goodness. Apparently it went in the shoulder. I've not tried it out, but most fear effects are actually based off um, fire. Silver greatsword, especially effective against under dead. No wonder I'm taking so much damage from these guys. Um, one of the other things that is very interesting that is affected by fire is fear. Because you can actually... The fire spells are um, tagged with the fear enchantment. One sec, did he have a key? He should have. Silver hand, hmm. 
last scabbard of I think this is either one hand or two handed can't remember um, and using the Careful. fear perk their leader is a tricky one they call her the Skinner I don't think I need to tell you why I assume is this her she's gonna get wrecked oh is it him who is the Skinner they're all skinning things on hides do we have slow time shouting here no we don't magic Powers, shouts, slow time. Great. This is only level one of the slow time shout. I've literally already been detected. Are you kidding me? Go away. But we should be able to get two shots off at least. I found you. Oh, she was hiding behind everyone. I see. Get out of here, Archer. Ayla, what are you... Look, look, come on. What are you... Are you kidding me right now? Are you actually kidding me, Ayla? Seriously? Actually stand up? Oh my goodness me. This is not good at all, Ayla. I am disappointed in you as a human being. Oh my god, are you not getting stunned or what? I love a good fight too, just not against a lady with a dagger who I can't stun very easily. Oh, she's not got a dagger anymore. That's interesting. That is very interesting. Oh, come on. Where's my stun? This is what happens when you stream on Master Difficulty. It's never usually a problem. Alright, let's do this properly and not use the slow time shout so I give my position away. Otherwise, Ayla gets a little bit excited and we all die. Where is that invisible wall? I mean, seriously, come on. Get out of... Oh, for goodness sake. Clearly my archery skills after trying to kill that bear earlier just aren't on point. I need Lydia back, guys. Lydia clearly makes a massive difference. This guy is aiming at me, but he should not know where I am. Can you see me? Maybe. Okay, as long as that body's in front of you, you can't get in. I'm liking this a lot. Oh, Jesus Christ, there she is. Whoa, what is that frame rate? Yeah, so fix your computer. There we go. That's better. Right, wait until she attacks. And you should be able to stun her. Right here. There we go. Dead. Oh, that's better. Man, she was trying to skin me because I'm a Khajiit. Maybe her moves are super effective against Khajiits. Nordic carved up. Oh my goodness. Sorry about that, guys. I have a bug where that mod is not meant to be installed. They're meant to wear underwear, but they're not. <laughs> Bastards. Somehow they managed to kill Skiora. He was one of the strongest we had. But numbers can overwhelm you. He should not have come without a shield brother. Get out of here. I'm going to make sure we got the last of them and see if there's any information to be gotten from the bodies. You and I have work to do. The silver hand will tremble at our sight. Well, I can give that Nordic armor to Lydia. Thank you very much for the donation. Oldest donator accolade. $6.61. Thank you. Good luck with... Okay, I've read that one before. I think there was another one up here as well, but I haven't read the chat because I was so busy trying to kill these bloody silver hand. Um, scroll down so I can read again. The Silver Great. Hand has been scouring the world for more pieces of Uthrak. One group has hidden out in White Run. Get it back for the honor of us all. The rest of the companion's quest line is basically about repairing this giant two handed sword called Wolfhound. Frostbite, don't need it. Increases your magicka by 10 points. I can sell it. Oh, restoration spells cost 20% less to cast. I can sell it too. Alright, let's have a quick look around here because there should be another boss chest. Wolf armor. Ah, oh, one second. Who is this? Skajor. I didn't realize he died. Ah, human flesh inside the werewolf. That's how you know they're a werewolf. Hello, Mr. Wealth. It's like he's trying to high-five me. High-five. Hey, hands off! What the hell? Get out. 
Okay. Let's leave this accursed place. Clearly this character is just not cut out to be a werewolf. If you guys do want to play a werewolf, definitely follow my guide. I'll add it to the description below. Don't build an archer character and expect things to be successful. We actually didn't loot this place earlier, did we? One second. Who the bloody hell is this? Are you actually kidding? How did, how did I miss this guy before? He's just sitting here having lunt this whole time. Behind you! Oh, get wrecked. Sit back down. Finally caught a stream. Thank you for the donation. I actually couldn't read your name because the chat's moving too fast. Nick, thank you. Glad you managed to catch a stream, man. I know it's hard for everyone because the time differences are so cray. Potion of healing. I do need that. Also, there's a chest we already searched. Daniel, thank you for the donation. Instant demonetization incoming. For sure, man. Okay, let's carry on and... Oh, one sec. This is not the right way. It is back here. That we need to go. Maybe I do. <laughs> okay, right. Let's uh, go to Skyrim. Hello, Lydia. I've got your back. Ooh, I actually need you to come with me. Clearly. One sec. Are you already following me? I will protect you with my life. I told you to wait there. Why is there still an option to tell you to wait there? That's weird. She is following me. Okay, great. Let's travel back with the piece of. Oh, one sec. What is our quest? Retrieve the fragment. Read anonymous letter. Okay, right. Let's go here and retrieve the fragment. I think it's in a random dungeon. For some reason they've put it here and we've already cleared this location. That's strange. DJ Orbix, do not worry about being if you're broke. It says that it's clear, but it's not. That's probably a good thing because I actually love clearing this location. So much. Oh, really? Lydia, come on. Ah, here we go. Get wrecked. Come on. Come back. Where am, where have my elite archery skills gone, guys? Clearly, I need some more practice. My rusty Skyrim archery is just not great, is it? Stop moving. Here we go. Okay. Just walk back. Okay, right. This guy's going to stand still. Great. He's going to die. Come on, Skyrim. Oh! Right in the back. It'd be so funny if he actually fell off the platform just then. Right. This guy right here. We should be able to hit him now. Oh, man. I missed again. Come on, ESO. What are you doing with your life? Right, we're going to sneak a bit closer because clearly I'm crap at archery. Dodge skills are elite. Yeah, they've they've got this really funny dodge mechanic where they will literally dodge straight right or straight left to ignore your bows. I mean, your uh, arrow. Oh, hello? What? Oh, Lydia, behind you. A half-dressed woman. Why is she banging her axe on her hand? What? This is a silver hand. What? Why is she chasing us? Get out. You're not meant to be here. Oh, actually, I guess they are because they're protecting the fragment. That kind of explains it, actually. That would make sense, at least. Get them. Lydia, please don't stand in front of me. I don't think I gave Lydia that Dwarven Bow. I'm not so sure how she got it. Oh, she is using the electric arrows. Awesome. Oh my god, we need to take out this bandit leader right now. Otherwise, okay, okay. We can kill him in one hit, don't worry. Get wrecked. That fool, oh, unless he falls right in the river. He should actually die in one hit. Great, he's dead. I think he might have the piece as well. I don't know. 
Either way, I kind of want to take that Nordic armor off him. The piece of wolf is up here anyway, so we can go and grab that right now. Oh, I really want to use my unrelenting force shot on this guy. Please cool down. Thank you. Look out. Dodge skills. Mad dodge skills. Are you ready, guys? Fast road. Da! Oh, my God. I can't even see where he landed. Jesus Christ. He is definitely dead. Oh, he just fell off the waterfall. <laughs> Get wrecked. Talon Norman donated $7. Thank you. Love you, man. Thank you for making life better. I hope you can figure out the monetization stuff. I hope so too, man. I really do. It is a bit worrying when stuff like this happens. Fragment. Look, it's a face. Hello. Can't remember which part of the weapon this is. It looks like the axe head. And that's where the, the handle attaches to. And then both of the blades attach to either side of the face. Ooh. A helmet of alchemy, eh? Glass sword? Yes, you can give that to Lydia. Hmm. Do I want to nap? Huh? Jesus, Lydia. Christ. How did you yes, know? I need you to trade things. Of course, sir. Of course, sir. I can get used to this. Ah. No, why do I keep looking for your weapons? I want to give you the glass bow. Well, I mean sword. There we go. She actually does use the electric carriage. That was pretty awesome. I want to see if... Wait, 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 wait. Oh, okay, right. So she will use the electric arrows, but she'll only use... She'll actually use them up, which is kind of annoying. She doesn't do it if I give her glass arrows, though, so we'll just give her two glass arrows, I think. And she can do a bit of extra damage. There you go, love. Lead on. Right, why am I getting frame drops? That is so weird. Bow of Arcing. This enchanted weapon is always here, by the way, guys. Now, we should be able to survive this fall, but just in case, I'm going to save the game first. Save, new save. Great, great job. Yes, so, oh, for goodness sake, I'm not going to survive. <sighs> Wasn't meant to slip off the edge there. Banter. Yes, so eat him on the altar. Who do you want me to eat on the altar? Jesus. That sounds pretty savage. Do you know what? Let's be safe. Mr. Cheesy Sweet Roll, now with bacon. Nazim for the Emperor. There we go. Now, where did that other guy's body go? I think he actually floated downstream somewhat. Don't actually know. One of the guys is here, but this isn't the guy I want... Where did the other guy go? I'm hoping he like hit a rock or something. Ah, yes, he did. Nordic carved armor boots. Did I have the boots? Just in case. You're carrying too much to be able to run. I better drop some stuff then. Uh, might as well drop that. I don't need it. I have two boots. I always have orcish armor I don't need. And this helmet, don't need that. Uh, no, we'll keep that. Just throw the rest of the stuff in the river, Lydia. Right. I do like your name, by the way. S uh, sweet roll with bacon. This deer. Come on, redeem myself right now. Yes, thank you, Skyrim. Don't vex me with your stupid... Really? Really? And then the deer just disappeared. What is this witchcraft? I'm actually like, like, what is this Skyrim? You've got to kill a deer and then we'll go back to Whiterun, okay? Something is going on here. Clearly Skyrim has... is annoyed because I haven't played her in so long. Aha, there is a wolf. Maybe I can save this deer. Come on. This is like, has to kill it, okay? Don't... Really? Look. What is going on here, Lydia? Watch it. You watch it. Right, let us travel back to White Run. What's on your mind? Okay, Lydia. 
What isn't on my mind? Skyrim is vexing me. Those kill cams, guys. I mean, seriously. Maybe you hit its hoof. I didn't realize that wolves had hooves. But uh, maybe you were right. Oh, one second. Was he outside? I think he was. I'm not going to try and say your nickname. I'm going to save myself the embarrassment. If I wait one hour, I reckon he'll just come inside. There we go. There he is. I've been there she is. Have you been bringing the battle to the Silver Hand? I've got the fragment. Another piece of glory. Good work, Shield Brother. Yes, another piece of glory. What's the next target? Good that you're so eager. Very. I've caught wind that one of the brighter Silver Hand has been sniffing around Whiterun. If you can sneak into their camp and steal his plans, we'll have the advantage. Bring glory to the companions. Stealing plans. Nigel Whiffin has donated another five dollars. Can anyone beat fifty-two-year-old donate donating ESO rocks? Thank you for the donation, Nigel. Right. Steal the plans from Red Around's retreat. I think we've been here as well, guys. It's quite close. Yes, it is. Ah, I... I actually think, guys. I want to show you something cool. If this is the dungeon I think it is... Which I think it is... There's a secret way in this dungeon. Okay. If I am correct. If not, I will just waste your time. But I know you guys love it when I do that. But there's actually a hidden little way we can get in that isn't so hidden. Unless you know it. Well, it's just unmarked on your map. Oh, I believe there are bandits out here somewhere. Basically, we can get to the bandit area if we ignore the entrance to Red Around's Retreat. And we go north. I mean, sorry, east. Easty northy. Up here towards this other location. I recall it being up here. I could be wrong about this. It could be the other dungeon. Um, but I feel like it is up here. A beehive. There's also some mammoths which we could potentially kill. Ooh, a bee. Look at this. Wow, how beautiful. Bzz. Beehive husk and honeycomb, which is good for eating. Right, so... Uh I'm sure it's around here somewhere. What I'm looking for, guys, is I think it's this dungeon. There's actually a giant pit which is built to for mammoths to fall into. That's part of Red Around's retreat. And you can actually jump into it. And um, it will take you right to the back of the location. But I can't actually remember whereabouts it is off the top of my head. I know it should be around here somewhere, if this is the right dungeon. If it's not, I'll let you know once we go inside. But I'm pretty sure it is. Okay, right. I'm going to give up and we're going to go back to the cave. Do you know what? Let's just fast travel there because I'm super lazy. <clears throat> yes, so I subbed. Thank you, Adster Gaming. I really appreciate it. Right, here we are. Let's go and kill some bandits, or silver hands as they are. A woofy. Goodbye. Get wrecked. Silly dog. You're not a real werewolf. Headshot! That was really weird. I didn't even see my arrow fly out of my bow. Apparently it did though. Oh goodness me. A lockpick. 14 iron arrows. Lincoln, thank you very much for the donation. I love watching your streams while pe while playing Skyrim myself, and don't worry, your archery skills are still better than mine. I feel like you're just saying that to make me feel better, but thank you nonetheless. <laughs> right, let's just run through this bit because there's no enemies until you get into this next area. Aha, here we go. Ah, no, it's not the location I thought it was. That's why the pit didn't exist. 
get wrecked. Here he comes. Oh, goodness me. I can't believe I messed that up. Last mistake, says Lydia. Go on, Lydia. Attack. Don't worry, Lydia. I've got his kneecap right here. Get wrecked. Look at that, that throwback there. I've got his kneecap too, Lydia. Don't worry. Oh, okay. My kill cams are so, like, wrecked right now. Get wrecked. See that kneecap a shot, Lydia? Can't compete. Such a savage. More Nordic armor. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I was meant to give Lydia the Nordic armor, wasn't I? Still here. That's what I was meant to do, guys. It's an honor to serve you. It is an honor to serve you. That is what I like to hear. Right. Nordic armor. Ah, the item is too heavy for Lydia to carry. Who do you think you are, Lydia? Not being able to carry things. Why do I even bring you along? You can actually drop some of this stuff, Lydia. Okay, you've got a few things here that we just don't need, do we? I will give you this Nordic armor. Uh, we need some Nordic gauntlets, Lydia. I'm not going to give you a helmet because, I mean... Why are you not putting it on? How can I serve you, my Don't friend? tell me. 59. 58. Nope. Get rid of the blade's armor. You've had it too long. Taking that back. And this back. I'm just going to drop this on the floor. Right in front of you. And you'll know how angry I am at you. Okay, right. Sort this out, guys. We don't need this. And we don't need these other silly weapons that he are carrying, is carrying around. Elven Dagger. Could use that, actually. For that 15 times sneak attack bonus. Uh, we need the Lunar Forge for the enchantment. Very good, sir. Very good indeed, sir. Right, so we need to get this thing before I forget. The Silver Hand Stratagem. Oh, you can't read it. It just picks it up. Ooh, a glass bow. I'm going to pick that up right now. And treasure map five, guys. I can actually show you. Do you guys want me to show you where this is right now on the stream? Let me know in the chat. I can do that. You have to have the treasure, treasure map to find it. Ah, sneaking is 25% better. Taking it. Man, this is like the best boss chest we've had ever live on stream. Love it. Right, another potion, potion of vigorous healing. I would like to be vigorously healed, Lydia. Right, that's everything we need from this location. Let's leave. Guys, what is the minimum level to do the Dawnguard DLC? Ah, oh, I can't remember exactly off the top of my head. You can literally start, like, they will approach you at a certain level, I do believe. Um, but you can start at any time you want by just going to Castle Dawnguard. Yes, I think I made a guide on where it was um, during a live stream, so you can go check it out if you're interested. Let's have a quick look for any wildlife before we move on back to White Run. There's a giant there tending his mammoth. I can't see any. Oh, one second. Look at this glass bow. Is that a deer? No, it wasn't. It didn't move. Wait. I don't think it is, no. I can't see any deer. Why are there no deer in Skyrim, guys? What's going on? Aha! A fox! Literally right in front of me. Get wrecked. Boom! The booty shot. Why is everyone saying level 10? Oh, right, level 10. That's when you can start the Dawn Guard. Thank you, guys, for reminding me. <clears throat> yeah, you can go straight there, though, so it doesn't matter. You can start at level 1 if you want to. Uh, right, let's go. Give in the next piece of the puzzle. 
This will probably tell us where the other pieces are hidden. And then we can go and find those too. And finally put together this giant two-handed axe. Which is actually the most damaging two-handed weapon in the game. Not the best two-handed weapon, but does the most base damage. Has a good enchantment as well. Aiden, you've missed everything. You've missed half of the stream. How dare you come at such a late hour. Robbie, thank you for subscribing. Ah, hello. I see. Ah, I shut the door. Goodbye, Lydia. You saved us all. We will sing of you forever. I've got the plans. Perfect. Hopefully this will let us know more about their movement. I think we've got them on the run. Okay. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Mr. Cheesy Sweet Roll now with bacon. Ten dollar donation. Yes, so do you go to the Cloud District very often? What do I say? Of course you don't. That is a quote by Nazim. You know what, sir, coming from you, I am fine with it. Thank you for the donation as well. <laughs> Jesus Christ, Lydia. Look at you, you're a true Nord. We just need to get you some Nordic gauntlets and a Nordic shield, and then you're going to be like Bay. Look, moonwalking Lydia, everyone saw that. Xander Hodges, thou halt... Uh, thou, uh, thou something will kill the deer? I didn't see that. Chat is moving so fast. It is such a struggle. Um, let's have a look. Where do I want to go now? Read. Oh, one sec. What did she actually tell me to do? Did she not tell me to go anywhere else? We've got the plans. Is it lagging? If it is lagging, I am sorry. It may be because of your upload speed, because I know mine should be fine. Have you been bringing the battle to the Silver Hand, friend? I wish I could be there with you. Soon enough. You could, but I you're kind that. of useless, I've so... I've heard you may actually be strong. Right. The Rising Dead. Mine's clearly sad. Da, 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 da. Approach the Night Mothers. Oh yeah, I was going to do a stream about the um, Night Perhaps Mother assassination contracts. I thought that'd be a pretty fun thing to do. Some nights I dream about the mists. Right, guys, what do you want to do before we carry on with finding the pieces of Wolfren? Whoa, Lydia, what the bloody hell? That was a bit weird. That was a bit disturbing. You can still go in the Underforge now, which is kind of interesting. You don't actually need to go in there for any particular reason right now, but hey, you can if you want to. Right, remove it. Talk to Kodlak. Is that, that's what I'm meant to do to continue the quest. I just need to find where Kodlak is. I assume he'll be inside, sleeping somewhere. Sometimes you find him out here, though. Let's just wait a few hours. It's 5 a.m. Oh. Whoa, that was weird. <laughs> Did you guys see that? Right, Tavar. Korea. Farkas. Oh, Farkas. Hey, now, you be careful with that fire. Until next I'm, time. Why is he saying that? You saved us all. I don't we have any fire. Mm. I assume he's inside. I just don't want him to come outside while I'm outside. Still inside. He doesn't leave this building, does he? What a fool. It would be a lot better if I remembered what he looked like. I've been tending the companion's careful. quest line is always the first quest line you do, but the um, the last, like, you forget it. Aha! This is him. Some nights I dream about the mists of Sovngarde. He's not going to give me the next part of the quest yet. I honestly do not remember to do what to do at this point. 
You guys want... Oh, you guys want me to find the treasure. Okay. Did you collect all the Dragon Priest masks? Not on this character, but I made a video about how to do it. Uh, I'm here for the ESO experience, not whatever the chat want to do. <laughs> don't kill Nazim. <laughs> it's your enchanted bow. I don't think the bow is enchanted with a fire effect, though it did cross my mind. Anyway, we'll have a look in a moment, but I want to show you guys where this treasure is. It's just around here. Are you going to play the Undeath mod? I have done a video review of it, but I mean, there's not really much to play, to be honest. <laughs> it's not that great. So, okay, guys, here we have. Let me just get the map out again. Let me have a quick look at this bow. Deals 15 points of stamina damage. That's why I didn't understand why he was saying be careful with those flames, because obviously it must be a bug. Uh, right. Books. Treasure map. There we go. Right, so this is the farm we're at now. Lauren would kill Nazim. <laughs> Thank you for the donation. <laughs> so this is the farm we're at now. And you can see the mountain is behind it there. You can also see there's an aerial view of the hold of White Run, and just south of it is the farm with the windmill, which we're at right now. So it's saying the treasure chest is somewhere X marks the spot just up that mountain. I obviously know where they all are just from playing the game for ages, but so you guys know how you know that's where it is, I just thought I'd explain that quickly for you guys. Assassinate Nazim. ESO, do not kill Nazim. Cameron, you seem to be the only person asking me not to kill him. Do the Dragonborn DLC. One sec. Let's have a quick look if we still have the book. With the plans. No, we don't. We gave it to our good friend. Right, let me show you where this treasure is, guys. Danny, you need to do a how to find the snow elf armor guide, bro. I guess I could do a separate guide for it about the elf armor, but um, you do get it at the end of the quest line. Squad Marvin donated $10. Thank you, sir. I love watching your streams and binge watching your video during work. Since I work from home, I just got my husband addicted to your videos too. Oh, I'm so glad. So here we go, guys. Here's the treasure chest. And here is the real treasure. The view over White's Run hold. I mean, look at this. Man, look at this. Oh my goodness. You can actually see, I think. Just over there is a dungeon or a cave called the White River Watch. And Mega Hego, thank you very much for the $5 donation. Love your channel. Love Bruma. Keep up the good content. I shall. Um, and there's also a good view from over there as well. For, oh my god, it's actually snowing right now. We can also see Hythrothgar over there. Can't remember what that mountain is over there or what that castle is. But I mean, this view is just awesome. We had a nice sunset and then it became cloudy. Damn it. Can't see anyone to shoot an arrow at, unfortunately. That's literally why you come up. Oh, no, no, there's a deer there. You can actually see that deer, guys. I can just see it right now. It's always hard to aim above things because of the way Skyrim is. I don't know if it's going to go above or below the deer. Okay, that did land quite close to it. What is the drop-off on this animal? There's no way I'm going to hit it. He's not moving anyway. So these arrows must be going quite... F oh my goodness me, I actually hit it. Well, where's my kill cam, Skyrim? Let's go and have a look what's actually in this treasure chest. Orcish boots of the ox. Carrying capacity increased by 45 points. Emerald, gold, emerald ring. Well, Lydia, you ox, I could give this to you. But I will not. 
Goodbye, Lydia. I will see you at the bottom of the mountain, my love. Jesus Christ, Lydia. My God. She is actually doing the world's longest roly-poly in Skyrim. Look at her. She's going to stand up right now. Come on, Lydia. Still be alive. Yep. See? She's alive. She's absolutely fine. She might be a little bit angry with me. May wake up with a bit of a headache tomorrow. But mostly, I think she'll be fine. I just heard someone draw their sword. And honestly, I don't know where that came from. Unless there are some... Bounty hunters behind me. But hey... Lydia's still alive, so that is a good thing. Guys, I hope you enjoyed this stream. I'm going to carry on with the Companions quest line in the next video. Now seems like a pretty good place to stop the quest line. Or I could do the survival mode um, instead. What do you guys want to do? Let me know in the chat. And I'll also put a poll down below in the description in a moment, which you guys can vote on. But thank you very much for watching, guys. I will see you in the next video the next stream i also stream randomly sometimes on my second channel so if you guys want to check that out um the link is also down below in the description i play a bunch of random games usually not related to skyrim uh, so it's pretty interesting if you just like random streams and i chat about stuff just random stuff during those gameplays as well you can also chat to me on my discord chat which is also linked down below in the description if you're interested please like the video if you haven't already and I will see you guys in the next one. So have a fantastic day. Have a fantastic day, guys. <laughs> Goodbye.